with another video and today we're actually going to be jailbreaking our iOS 5.0.1 and I know this is an old jailbreak but the reason why I'm doing this is because if you saw my last video I did downgrade from 5.1.1 down to 5.0.1 and I want to show y'all that it's really easy to jailbreak once you're in 5.0.1 because this is my iPhone 4s and at the current moment there is no jailbreak for 5.1.1 so the reason I downgraded was so I can jailbreak my iPhone 4S so now it's running 5.0.1 and just to show you real quick we'll simply go into settings and then right here and then we'll go down here to 5.0.1 that's my version which is the IPSW slash firmware that I'm running on my iPhone 4S so I want to show you all that with the latest version of Red Snow which is 0.9.11 before you can actually easily jailbreak your iPhone 4S by just simply hitting jailbreak and all that and also if you're running any A4 device meaning any iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, iPod 3G, 4G and the iPad 1 you can simply jailbreak your iOS device just by hitting jailbreak if it is running 5.1.1 currently I am running 5.0.1 as we discussed that in the very beginning so all we have to do is simply hit jailbreak and so as you see on screen this is a whole new jailbreak it is different now Red Snow has updated it so we can do like this so it does ask or please approve the jailbreak profile on your device so we'll simply tap on install right down here on our device and then we'll hit install now so now it's just gonna go ahead and hit next because there is no password and then we will hit on done so now it will go ahead and do all its thing and prepare the jailbreak and then this is way easier than putting your device in DFU mode and all of that so Red Snow has been updating their stuff and been making it way way easier than before so so we'll just let this sit and run through all of this and then we'll come back once it is finished Alright guys, now on screen it does say please turn on the VPN settings, so we'll simply slide to unlock right here, and then I just got an email from iHeartRadio, <laughs> but let's go ahead and turn on our VPN settings to trigger the jailbreak install, so once we do that, we just simply wait, and then it will continue the jailbreak, so it just said jailbreak succeeded, so it's successfully installed, it will reboot on its own, so go ahead and it will reboot, just leave it alone and then we will have a jailbroken device. Alright, now it has successfully rebooted and everything, so we'll simply scroll over and there's that iHeartRadio. <laughs> email again come on iHeartRadio quit bothering me so now we slide over to the right we do see Cydia right there go ahead and open up Cydia and then it will prepare your file system this may take a minute or so so just let this sit alright now it has prepared the jailbreak and everything so we'll simply a slide to unlock again and then we'll open up Cydia and then now it's gonna ask who are you well am I a user hacker or developer normally I do do developer but for now if you're not familiar with jailbreaks just go ahead and use user and then we'll simply tap on done on the top right and then now you will get the welcome to Cydia screen so now you have officially jailbroken your iPhone 4s with 5.0.1 Normally before we had to use Absinthe if you're familiar with that jailbreak tool But now Red Snow has been updated of course to simply run the jailbreak on your iPhone 4s Running 5.0.1 and this is untethered by the way, so that's awesome So guys, that's gonna be it for this jailbreak if you like this jailbreak and it helped you out Please leave that 
thumbs up and hit that little like button in the bottom left to show me that you like this video and also if you have any questions or anything like that leave that in the comment section below and I'll reply as soon as possible and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button up top for more jailbreaks city of tweaks and tutorials and all that good stuff so until next one guys thanks for watching and I will catch y'all on the next one peace